Good evening, everyone. Tonight we're gathered here to remember and celebrate the life of a fabulous woman, Dr. Dorothy Simon. I've known and worked with Dr. Simon in her home for the last two years, where I've heard stories of her life and gotten to know the amazing woman that she is. She was not only a role model to me, but also a friend. I want to tell you Dr. Simon's accomplishments in her time in the science field, as well as touch on the amazing woman she was overall. Dr. Simon excelled in her professional life. Her father was the head of a science department at Southwest Missouri University for many years when she was a child, where she grew into her love for chemistry. She went on to get her PhD in physical chemistry with many honors and completed postdoctoral studies in England, where she met her husband. She was very respected in a male-dominated career at the time. She developed many things in the science community, including developing a synthetic fiber and isolated a new isotope of calcium. One of her greatest accomplishments by far was while she was working at NASA. She did much research on combustion and developed the idea of what we know today as the heat shield on the front of space shuttles so that they don't blow up when they re-enter the atmosphere. Although she did not receive credit for her amazing and successful idea since she was a woman, she accepted many awards for her accomplishments in science. Without her, we would not be able to do all of the scientific research that we're able to do by going into space today. Not only was Dr. Simon a wonderful scientist, she was also one of the most genuine and loving women I have had the pleasure of knowing. Dr. Simon was not only a wonderful scientist, but also a wonderful person. She was very genuine and kind-hearted and was loved by all of those around her. She was a loving wife and friend. She brightened any room that she walked into and was always there when you needed her the most. When I would come into work having a terrible day in a terrible mood, when I would see her, she could tell immediately if something was bothering me and would tell me to sit down and talk about it. She knew how to make even the worst days for me better. Not only did she do this for just me, but also she did it for those around her. She was soft-spoken, but you would know when she said something that it was important, and you would listen. Her advice was always valuable. She supported me and challenged me to follow my goals. She told me how hard it was being a woman in her field, but that you can do anything that you put your mind to. She's one of the reasons I'm going back to nursing school. She's one of the reasons I'm following my goals, even though it's going to be difficult. Dr. Smith, Dr. Simon was an amazing woman and will be greatly missed. Overall, Dr. Simon was an amazing woman. She led great innovations in science through her thorough knowledge in chemistry, and she made great strides in her, professional, in her personal life since she was such a kind lady. In my opinion, and in the opinion of many others, Dr. Simon will always be remembered for her impact on science and the impact she left on the lives of others. Let's take a moment to remember the life of Dr. Simon and appreciate her great innovations. Thank you for listening.